<clears throat> yeah. <laughs> this is Jamison Tilsner of Tilsy TV, and he's here with the uh, the creators, directors, and star of Kyle Piccolo, Comic Shop Therapist. Now, without further ado, here's Jamison. Thanks so much. So, why don't you introduce uh, you all? Introduce me to yourselves. Uh, just tell me your name and your role in the project. Hi again. Uh, I'm Neil Turritz. I co-created it with Alec Pollock, who's sitting over there. You can pan over to Alec. Great. There's Alec. And uh, I write with all these guys, and I direct with this guy here, John Cassidy. Say hello, John. And I'm John Cassidy, and I direct with Neil, and we're all producers, and I'll hand the mic over here. Uh, I'm Eric Zuckerman. I play Kyle Piccolo, comic shop therapist, uh, and I also write with these, these lovely, lovely gentlemen. Thank you. Thank you. So sweet. You play the piccolo. I don't actually. All right. I'm Alec Pollock, uh, one of the co-creators with Neil and one of the writers with the rest of these guys. Tell me about the uh, development of the concept here. What inspired you? Well, Alec and I are both big comic book geeks, and uh, we big. were big, big geeks. Well, the geeks, huge, huge geeks, and we happen to like comic books. Uh, and we were having, uh, we went to college together. We had lunch one day a few months ago. Uh, we bumped into each other, and we were talking, and he told me about this thing that he does, work in developing internet content. And we said we should put like a sitcom in a in a comic book store, and that's really how it started. And also, we would figured if we did that, uh, we'd somehow find a way to get free stuff out of it too. So, Alec, you want to add to that? There are a lot of comic book shows already out there where it's a bunch of guys, kind of like we're doing right now, sitting on couches talking about comic books, and that's great for kind of like finding out about the newest books or doing reviews and stuff like that. But there was no other content that was really aimed at comic book fans that was in the world of comic book fans. And, and so, so this is a narrative about comic books or about the world of comic books? Yeah, basically it's, it's set in the world of the comic shop, uh, much like any other office sitcom might be set in an office. Uh, this is a workplace sitcom. It just happens to be that uh, Kyle here is the uh, king of the castle at the comic shop. And what is that? What, he's a therapist? He's a comic shop therapist? What does that mean? You want to explain um, that? Well, you know, he, he helps people with, uh, with their problems, whether or not they, uh, they have problems, think they have problems, want him to help them with their problems. Uh, he's just, he's one of those guys, he's just, he, he, uh, he thinks he can help. I think that's genuine. It comes from a, a, a genuine place. Uh, but he's also, he's also selling comics, and he always makes a sale with his advice. You know, he uses a comic book as a sort of Oh, read this, and it'll help you figure out that problem. But he's he's selling you a comic but when he's his, doing it. But his advice, I gather, is not disingenuous. No, it's not disingenuous at all. It's just maybe a little uh, pointed, uh, stilted, yeah, stilted, pointed, <laughs> loaded. Uh, loaded uh, yeah, it, sometimes a little much. This is a comedy series. You don't see it appealing just to comic book fans necessarily. It could appeal to someone like me who's never read a comic in his life. Right, you want to? Yeah, well, we want it to be accessible to everyone. We want, we want uh, whether you've read a comic ever or not, uh, uh, you know, we want this to be just, just be funny. And there will be, there will be little winks to the, to the core comic audience here and there, but in general, we want anyone to be able to watch it and, uh, and get, a, get a chuckle out of it. I mean, ultimately, uh, ultimately funny is funny. Uh, no. Yes, it is, it's actually. Really yeah, it really is, actually. No, if something is funny, regardless of, of what the genre is or what the setting is, you know, I mean, who would have thought that, uh, you know, something, uh, uh, people working in a uh, paper supply, an office supply company in Scranton would be funny. Uh, but they make it funny. And, you know, Funny's with us... Fun. Exactly right. Yeah, that, I've heard that somewhere before, actually. Uh, so with us, it was just, as Alex said, taking the idea of putting it in a different workplace that we th feel is rife with comic possibilities because the truth is is that every comic book clerk I've ever met and I've spent the last 25 years hanging out in some form or another in comic book stores has been some form of know-it-all so it's like okay let's run with that and see how far we can take it the show is sponsored by uh, the first uh, five or six episodes six or episodes. six episodes are going to be sponsored by uh, Warner Brothers new film The Dark Knight Midtown Comics is one of our sponsors as well in that uh, they're allowing us to shoot at Midtown Comics, which is fantastic. We love the guys there. They've been very helpful and are hoping that it's going to be an ongoing series and that'll be their home. You know, Kyle's spent uh, probably most of his life in, a, in the comic shop. He understands 
the the patterns of comics that get that put on the on the counter in front of him so he can actually see he sees people come in I mean people come in every week some people don't but there are plenty of people that are coming in every week and he can see a pattern of oh you know this guy's been been uh, always getting this you know these superhero things and then all of a sudden oh there's an Archie digest like what's going on with this guy something's going on you know that's he, he's intuitive in that in that regard in that he looks he looks first at the books and then at the person sometimes the best advice is obvious and with that I think we'll close <laughs> <laughs> this wonderful interview it was a pleasure speaking to all of you thank you so much and and except you yeah. Funny but you knew that. I get that a lot. Yeah, and uh, what is this? Did you want to share this book? No. By the way? No? Okay. Okay. Sure. We can find it all at? KylePiccolo.com. KylePiccolo.com. Kyle Thanks, guys. Thank, Thank you. you.